Yo, see guys, Ben and Fire here back from a video, and today we're going to be hopping into a, another offensive video in College Football 25. Today we're going to be running the Pistol Strong Formation, which is going to be a very good passing set, and it has a lot of unique runs. Triple Option Switch, we have Triple Option Slip, Off Tackle, Regular Triple Option, so we're going to try and get this playoff with the Regular Triple Option, just real quick, if we can. Hand the ball off. We're going to be running the ball a lot. We are in Kansas's playbook, of course. Now let's try and set up our audibles. We want the regular triple option in there. Stretch is fine. X post will be our passing. Or we'll, we'll leave PA boot LT as our passing play, and then we'll throw in like triple option slip. Now, obviously, triple option switch. We have a lot of cool stuff here. And he is in a 3 4 odd look, which is not going to be ideal. Here we fake the toss, Jalen Daniels off to the races, and that is a 43 yard gain. So if you guys don't know how to fake the toss, you just double tap LB. That really got his user going there. Uh, he fell for it completely, and then we're able to take advantage. Now, I do love the off tackle in this just because if they are stacked against it, you have a lot of good blocks to the left. Like you have the tight end right here, and then you have the running back going to that side. So if we want to call the off tackle, it's basically like an inside zone and you see right there we pick up another massive gain of about nine yards uh, now obviously it's gonna be ideal to have two good running backs in this set if you can obviously you have a power option as well see so we have some other things that we like well let's go with the triple option slip here now this is gonna be a variation of the regular triple option just going to the other side I probably should have kept it there but uh, we got a third down. We'll probably go pass here. So when I'm going pass, I usually do like throw in the tight end back there. Now be careful with this because you don't want your opponent to obviously catch on. Hey, he's doing that every play. Now I'm just going to take off there. Uh, he only rushed three, so definitely makes sense. Now, I do like the strong slot. I actually did post a video on this formation as well. So we do have that, which is nice. But um, looks like the running back is still tired for whatever reason. We are going to try and go back to the ground here. I think the triple option. This play looks good. Obviously, I made the mistake of, keeping the, or of handing the ball off. but And we're able to get the toss off, and we do get into the end zone. So, overall, very good first drive for us. Played it slow, and he is in a heavy run defensive formation. He is not in a nickel. He is not in a dollar or a dime. He is in a 3-4 heavy defensive set. So, the fact that we were able to do that very well on the first drive is a good sign, of course, for us. You know, going forward in this game. And just a good sign for the offense. I mean, if it's good against a really good run defensive set, um, it's going to be good against really the ones that you see every day, the nickels. And even then, probably should have handed the ball off initially. But we do get it to work. So... Let's kick this ball off, see if we can pick up a stop defensively. Now, I am in my playoffs. Um, just FYI, that's why it's the Cotton Bowl or whatever. Uh, defensively, you guys kind of know what we like doing. I like coming out in a nickel set. So we're going to start out in just like a default nickel look. He's in the bunch wide, which is an interesting set. Now we do want to watch out for <sighs> Z-Spot and go there, first play. Now, Luther Burden is the real deal. We got to watch out for him on every play. Brady Cook, obviously decent as well. Now, defensively, we're okay. We're obviously not amazing. And Missouri is obviously a better rated team in this game. But that's perfectly okay. That should be picked. Burrows. Nice there. 
that's really good to get a stop on the first drive. You went with just a heavy four verts look. Now, I don't know why this running back is tired. We don't really have anyone else amazing, and I don't want to hand the ball off, so we'll just sub him in. I'm going to go back to the regular triple option here. Now, one thing we can also do is go with motion. You could motion this player over. I am going to flip real quick just to get better numbers over here. Did that not look like he was collapsing on the run? It definitely did. That's weird because he totally crashed on the run. So the fact that he played that is confusing to me. Now I think I could motion over Grim over here. I'm not sure 100% if he can. I guess maybe not. We could motion this guy in or whatever if we wanted. There we get the flip to work perfectly. See if this guy can have enough speed to get to the end zone, and he does. Perfectly executed, and again, it's just so easy to run this because even if like you make the mistake, like I definitely probably should have. <laughs> what? <laughs> that scared me. I had my monitor sound on, and that dude just starts screaming. Holy crap. I muted him, so we're all good. <laughs> he was pissed. I don't know <laughs> what that was. This guy's not having a fun time right now, defending the triple option. That's hilarious. That sc <laughs> scared me, holy crap. He just started screaming into his mic. I did not, I have my monitor sound on like five. He's on a happy camper. Um. What was I saying? I was saying, yeah, you make the wrong decision, you can still like toss it off. I should have handed the ball off there. It still works out for us. Okay. Nice tackle, buddy. Can't be too mad at Burroughs. He did just make the interception for us. But we need some better effort than that out there. Play action. Wow, comeback route. That's a good comeback route against my man coverage. Get him. Now it'd be nice to hold him to three here because he will actually get the football at half. Goes with a little screen action. Make the tackle, that's gonna take us to the two minute warning. He hasn't thrown over the top once, really. Oh no, we're stuck on the wrong guy. Oh my god! Just... If I'm not on the D-line, that's the easiest pick ever. Alright, let's go man. Not getting much pressure at the moment. That's a good user.
tackle. Not going to use the timeouts yet. We will just see how this plays out. I'll use the timeout if this play is down in bounds. I'm just going to go with a... Um, let's go with a cover two, try to bait him into an interception. Since the hash marks are so far out in this game, it's kind of harder to see, to be honest. He's going to run it in. That's fine. We do have a little bit of time here, so if we can score, obviously that's going to be ideal. But that was a good drive by him overall. I mean, he did make some good passes. Uh, not the best defense. I probably should have just stuck in the cover four, which I'll probably run for the kind of the rest of the game. And he's going to like men and actually go for two. I don't honestly even have amazing run defense out of anything, so... So cover to invert. Nice play call, bud. Thank God he went for two. Go rage on the mic again. Uh, now I probably won't run as much triple option just because one minute, nine seconds. Although, hey, it's been a pretty high powered play. I think, oh, I was going to say, I thought this guy messaged me, but he didn't. All right, let's throw off some of the passing game. I mean, obviously, even on the passing play we ran, we kind of uh, ran the ball. So let's try and cook out of the passing game here. I do like calling the play action plays. Reason being is you can um, you can run off them really easily. I need to go drag there because that this guy's dropping everybody in coverage. Let's go try and hit it like a corner out or something out there. Catch the ball, bro. Just gonna take it to the half there. You know, obviously it's fourth down. I thought he would have called a timeout, then I would have went for it, but because he didn't, I'm fine taking that to the half. We should run a quick triple option, see what we could do. It actually ended up working well, but it's just hard to run the two minute offense. I mean, if he caught the ball, we'd be looking a lot better. He ran a good match play on the deeper pass when I was trying to hit that corner route. Yeah, that guy matched onto it, so. Um, not drawing up the greatest route combos at the moment, but we'll see if we can uh, work some things out here in the second half. Wow. 
He threw it to the one guy that wasn't covered. That's a good read. I was really over that one. Pressure is not looking amazing at the moment either. This is the same play he ran earlier. There we go. Nice sack from uh, Robinson. Do we have some better guys out here? Why is this 71? Who's the 71? I thought I subbed him out. He goes to the ground. Good tackles. We've had really good tackles here. Let's see if we can get off the field on third nine. This would be key. He's going to go back to the five wide, which honestly, five wide is good against cover four. But I don't really know what else to run. We are all over that, though. That's good coverage. And I think my zone drops are on default or still messed up a little bit. There's no way. <laughs> the pressure of this formation is fucking awful. Why were you sprinting over? I should have sent the uh, spy. See, I'm trying to like send pressure, but nothing is working. Let's try and send some edge heat here. What the hell? It's fucking tackle, dude. That's pressure. Screen. Oh my god, you didn't shed? Come on, dude, you had the outside leverage. How the hell do you let him get out? That's good defense. Oh my God, what is <laughs> is this the state of defense in college football 25 right now? Like what are, there's no way he should have picked up a yard on that play. Now he's gonna run a stupid ass two point conversion. Held him off there, so we do keep the lead. We just need to put up six here. And because he went for two, the game should be pretty good. Close to over. All right. I mean, you still can't really stop the run. Could I have pitched it? Yeah, we're just going to keep it there, pick up the first, and um, let's go to the two-minute warning here. Or not the two-minute warning, let's go to the end of the quarter. I 
I cannot believe that he got those runs off. Those are crazy. Now, one thing to notice is that obviously the formation does look different when you run like the triple option slip versus the other one. We also do have a, oh, this is the wrong. Like if you guys did notice. Like running this play is different now. Because he's stacking the box, I'm gonna try and run the stretch to the outside. So that's a really good run. If he's really stacking the box, trying to kill that triple option, you can run the stretch and have like a lot of success with it. Also, the stack box could help with this. Now, I don't wanna run the ball to the other side, so I'm gonna try and pitch this regardless. I really uh, accidentally double tapped there, but the pitch would have been open. Regardless, we're going to the two minute warning here. And I might run that play again. I'm probably gonna go back to the stretch. If he's gonna come out of the 4-4 split, it makes no sense for me not to. Now I had the pitch open. Um, it was definitely open. Oh my God, bro, we gotta pick up that block. We got a pass here. Let's cook up a dot. That's so stupid. Nice pass there. We used the corner route. I'm glad you guys could see me uh, finally complete a pass. It's going conservative. He's gonna burn his last time out. Clock management wise, we got minute, minute, two more downs. This game will be close to getting killed. Honestly, we wanna try and use as much clock as we can actually here. Oh my God. I would have juked if I could have. Got a running backs tired. This guy is still tired. Uh, I'm gonna burn a timeout just to get in the right play. And maybe my player will not be gassed if we burn a timeout. I don't know why he's tired, bro. We cannot be tired on this last play of the game, man. Come on, man. Gotta go stretch here. He's gassed, but he gets through. 